Because wait, wait, here comes my favorite part. The following contest is in a elimination match. Making his way to the ring from Panama City, Florida, weighing in at 205 pounds, Adam Cole. The leader of Undisputed Era. From a journey around the world to bursting on the scene at NXT TakeOver Brooklyn 3, Adam Cole is finally on the big stage where he's wanted to be all along. The mission statement has been very simple. Shock the system. If you're gonna talk the talk, you gotta walk the walk, and Adam Cole has done everything and then some. Steve Austin once described him as fallacious inside the ring and on the microphone. I agree with the rattlesnake. One of the most dangerous strikers in the game, representing the undisputed era. Kyle O'Reilly gets things done inside the ring. And from Vancouver, British Columbia, weighing in at 200 pounds, Kyle O'Reilly. Kyle O'Reilly has traveled the world over, learning new ways to hurt his opponent. Proficient in Brazilian jiu-jitsu, kickboxing, and many other martial arts. Yeah, equally as equipped to trade strikes as he is to cinch in a debilitating submission hold. I got a feeling someone's about to get their lights turned out, and it's not Kyle O'Reilly. From Saratoga Springs, New York, weighing in at 197 pounds, Bobby Fish. A member of the Undisputed Era. Man's got a, a tremendous resume, trained by the great Harley Race. All the natural talent in the world. And a mean streak as well. Rugged, gritty, world-traveled, universally feared. Bobby Fish knows more than enough ways to hurt anyone he steps in the ring with. And a proud enforcer of the Undisputed Era's mission statement to simply shock the system. This young man here is an incredible talent. And from Tampa, Florida, Weighing in at 200 pounds, the NXT North American Champion, Roderick Strong. Looking at a superstar who started at the very bottom from a broken home, scratched, bit, 
scraped and clawed his way to the top and has never looked back. Amsterdam, Holland, weighing in at 215 pounds, Alistair Black. The ominous man from Amsterdam. Black emerged from the darkness just long enough to knock someone's head clean off. Black's a trained kickboxer, also studied the Indonesian martial art of Pensac Salat. Former NXT champion was undefeated for a year upon his arrival in the WWE. The presence and aura unmatched. Ave Satanas. He's here. Capitol Hill, Washington, D.C., weighing in at 227 pounds, the Velveteen Dream. An entrance. Intoxicating, mesmerizing. A mega star destined for the stratosphere in sports entertainment. Yeah, known for his combination of ruthlessness and unbridled. Flamboyancy. Anything you can do, the Velveteen Dream can do better. Velveteen Dream just soaking in every ounce of the moment. Everything about this guy is money. What a superstar. What an entrance. It's, it's mesmerizing. It's intoxicating. What is he doing? Anything he wants. He's the dream. You just don't appreciate greatness, Byron. I'm learning. The in bruising from the behemoth. Rocky Mountains, weighing in at 303 pounds, Lars Sullivan.
freakishly powerful, incredibly intelligent. Lars Sullivan is like no one you've seen before. Like a walking nightmare, hell bent on devouring anything that has a heartbeat. And a frame that'll block out the sun itself. Imagine waking up to that sight. Well, not literally. That'd be the worst case scenario. before arriving in WWE. And now that he's here, it's a dream come true. Johnny will not let his dream slip through his fingers. Devoted fans of sports entertainment know there is a long and sorted history between Adam Cole and Roderick Strong. The superstars have been tag team partners and bitter rivals, and the rivalry is going to new heights in NXT. And the encounters Cole and Strong have had since crossing paths in NXT have been simply brutal. The animosity could last forever. I guess time doesn't really heal all the wounds out of If you haven't hit record yet, now might be a good time to do that. These guys are going to have a match you'll want to watch over and over again. Let's remember, Roderick rejected Adam Cole's offer to join the Undisputed Era. Besides dream. being a stupid and move, that was also unbelievably disrespectful. Okay, whether you agree with Rogers' decision to turn down the offer from the Undisputed Era or not, Strong had to do what he felt was right. But you can bet Cole, Fish, and O'Reilly will want to make him pay for that every opportunity they get. Tremendous ring presence from the apron. This is not the place where you want to underestimate your competition. Absolutely not. Incredible striking combo. Harsh impact. Defensive here, but he's not appearing too worse for wear, at least not yet anyway. I'd like to inform the WWE Universe that they need to remember that Adam Cole has dominated the ranks of every promotion he competed in before honoring NXT with his presence. And don't ever forget it. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Ooh! That's how you use the ropes to your Mark advantage. Sullivan has been eliminated. You gotta believe this one's over. 
Let's put the focus back on what you informed us of, Corey, and that's Adam Cole's impressive career before coming to NXT. It's an internationally acclaimed resume that includes many singles and tag team titles. Yeah, that resume also includes competing in the Tokyo Dome, Michael. Actually, that match was against Undisputed Era cohort Kyle O'Reilly. Back then, Adam Cole knew what being too sweet was all about. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Ah, kick! Nasty kick. What a stomp! Good groove. Nasty impact. Nobody does it quite like him. That might be the end of Fish tonight. Did you say he's filleted? When I think of Adam Cole, looking for the exclamation point. Beautiful technique. Kyle O'Reilly set it up. Pulls the line. Oh, oh, it's over. Incredible striking combination. I need to return to Corey's gushing over Adam Cole's supposed finer qualities. I'm going to look at it another way. There are many who believe Adam is irreverent, braggadocious, obnoxious, and arrogant. The crazy part is, I think Adam Cole would beam with happiness either way he was described. While some of these things can be debated, one thing that is, dare I say, undisputable is Adam Cole's success. He's looking banged up here, guys. And it looks like things are about to get even worse. Oh, boy, he is rolling. What a strike. What a strike. Gotta wonder how this is gonna end, Byron. Whatever happens, it's not gonna be good. I can tell you that. Oh my! These guys are giving it absolutely everything they've got. When this guy's on, look out. Oof! Johnny Gargano has been eliminated. There's the last competitor eliminated. It's over. Let's take another look at these guys getting after it. And last but not least. Here is your winner, Kyle O'Reilly. Wow, what an amazing performance we saw here in this elimination match. You have to give credit where credit is due. That was one of the gutsiest performances I've seen in a very long time. Thank you for tuning in tonight, folks. We hope you enjoyed that great match.